welcome back everybody this is in the Shropshire garden um, I'm gonna make a video today for you um, regarding fuchsia cuttings um, I, I took a few more from another couple of plants well three plants um, the other day and I've put some of them in the them, them ones are just the standard red and white ones that you see uh, quite often but I'm gonna do one today um, a little story behind this it's not really interesting, but I'll tell you anyway. Uh, last year I bought um, a climbing fuchsia that wanted to grow up some trellis. Um, and it was doing really well, a um, really nice plant. And then over the winter it didn't fare too well and the roots got a bit manky and a lot of them died. So I had to cut off all the, uh, the bad roots to try and stop it spreading. <coughs> and um, just bob it in some nice compost to try and help it on its way and uh, build itself back up this this summer so it's um it's 27th of august today um and i've uh, i've decided to take a few cuttings because it is starting to come now but i think it's spent most of the summer just trying to build itself up with its roots system and and that so i thought right i'm going to take some cuttings while it's doing well and then hopefully i've got three more plants to that just in case the original uh, roots, the original plant, plant roots decide to fail. Um, so it's just really a backup, um, backup plan. Um, if it does make it through winter, I've got th three more plants. So um, I noted that I've not shown you how I take, few, how I take fuchsia cuttings in uh, past videos. I've just shown you the aftermath when I potted them up. So we'll do this today. This one is called, um, it's, like I say, it's a climbing fuchsia and it's called the Lady in Black. Do not sing, Jez. Jez, do not sing. I'm tempted then. It's on it, it's past. Right, so here we go then. If you've seen the other videos with the other plants, uh, you'll know that we do it from the node. Um, same again, really. Same rule of play. Um, that's what we like to do. And we like to get the uh, the young shoots, the new shoots, because they've got a better chance of coming than, uh, than anything that's a bit barky. Um, and... Um, and old. So here we go then, so I'll strip some leaves off, snip them off there. Um, which one shall I take it from? Shall I take it from that one or that one? Decide Jez. Right, we'll take it from, <laughs> we'll take it from the lowest one. So same again, just below the node. A diagonal cut if you can. That's where the roots are going to grow out of. Take these middle leaves off at the other node, next node up. These buds off. And of course the shoot off and remember as it's rooting and you've set it in some in some muck. Anything that starts growing out of the top, nip it off, then it can concentrate all its energy on growing roots down yonder. Same again with the leaves. Does no damage to the actual plant. What it'll do, because it's not spending all its moisture on the leaves, it'll concentrate on keeping it in the plant and helping root growth. And what I'm going to do this time as well, I'm going to use the rooting tooting powder rooting tooting so i'm just going to wet the end of this cutting get a little dip in there plenty of rooting powder on it and bob him in there nice and easy And I've said before as well, I've found that fuchsias are one of the easiest cuttings I've ever um, taken from any plant, really. Um, really easy to do. Um, so if you've got a fuchsia plant, by all means get some cuttings off it and then uh, you can grow them on and um, sell them or give them to your mates as presents. But they are really, really easy and um, I think I'll start doing... <laughs> plenty more of these <coughs> in future so yeah 
I'll do an update video later when uh, these guys have grown roots so I can show you all that. And um, don't forget to subscribe. If you're enjoying these videos, if you're getting anything from them, please hit the like button as well. That'd be lovely. Um, I'm going to be doing later on today um, a lemon tree cutting as well. I took some more off it the other day. I recorded it. <clears throat> but when I played it back, for some reason it recorded in fast forward. <laughs> it looked like End of Ben Hill. But, uh, so yeah, I'm going to have to redo that for you. So I've just got another little uh, lemon tree cutting and I'm going to be doing that later on today for you. So I hope you like the video. Please subscribe and I'll see you next time and take care. Toodaloo!